And this is just really stunning, uh, compelling video. They trying to break through the window there of the car as the car is on fire. Well, anyway, we are going to talk to Fox 10's Steve Nielsen. I'm bringing him in right now, and he's been on this story. Um, Steve, kind of give us the latest. It's such dramatic video. Um, you know, how is the man who was in the car and are the police officers being hailed today? Oh, they're absolutely being hailed. Uh, no doubt about it. These were life saving actions they took. Uh, so first off, yeah, you're right. The most important point here, the driver's actually recovering at the hospital and OK, which when you watch this video, that seems just nearly impossible. How it all got started was these two officers, Rudy Castillo and Joel Kaminsky. They're both 20 plus year officers with Phoenix Police. These are veterans. They know what they're doing. They were just about a half a mile away on Thursday morning when they got a call to rush to the scene for a car fire. They didn't know exactly what they'd be running into. And when they got there, they found an unconscious man behind the steering wheel. So that's when they ran to that man. They were trying to get in, but the doors were locked. The windows were up. Obviously, they couldn't wake him up. He was unconscious, so they couldn't get into the car. So Officer Kaminsky, he had one of those uh, break glass tools that we see a lot. He was trying to use it on the window, which you see in the video, but it actually broke in his hand, that tool. And when it broke in his hand, it slashed his hand open. He needed a few stitches later because of that. And there were the homeowner where this, uh, where this crash happened on his front lawn, he had brought a fire extinguisher out while police were on their way, these two officers. The fire extinguisher, it didn't